in our Quicken Loans game of the week. 9-0 Crosby looks to complete a perfect regular season and win the district title outright. New Caney sits one game back of Crosby and is looking to knock off the Cougars and earn a share of the district crown. Enjoy tonight, have fun, all right, and do what we do. Protect the jungle tonight. Don't let somebody come in here and take what's yours in our jungle. Crosby and New Caney are both fired up and ready to claim the district title. Crosby strikes first, though. Direct snap to running back Christian Solis, and he punches it in from the two. It's 7-0 Cougars. But New Caney has plenty of firepower. Anthony Robles gets the carry, and he bounces off defenders like a pinball. He scores from 17 yards out to tie it up at seven apiece. The Eagles' offense is just getting started. The quarterback, Jordan Cooper, keeps it on the read option. He'll go 70 yards untouched for the score. New Caney goes up 14 to seven. The Cougars respond with some read option of their own. Jaden Howard keeps it and slips out of a couple of tackles and takes it 20 yards for the score to make it 14 to 13, New Caney. The Eagles start to put the pedal to the metal, though. Robles scores from seven yards out, and it's 21-13 after one. In the second, Cooper connects with Dwight McLaughlin, and McLaughlin does the rest. He trots in for a 40-yard touchdown play, and New Caney leads 28-13. More Eagles to come. The same duo, Cooper throwing up the jump ball for McLaughlin, and he hauls it down in the end zone for a 27-yard score. Eagles up 35-13. It's all New Caney the rest of the way. Cooper goes back to the ground and scampers in for a 12-yard score. And New Caney cruises past Crosby 63-38 to claim the district title. 